Hey, what's up guys? Happy Friday. It's Abby hanging out with you in the mix studio today and today is the day a lot of people have been waiting for for a really long time. Taylor Swift released her new album Reputation at midnight. It actually got leaked online early. So it was out yesterday, kind of, sort of. I mean, it wasn't supposed to be, but it was, but it's officially out now and I have a problem with that. I have a big problem with that actually. So Taylor Swift right away with Reputation, it's been everywhere. It was on the sides of UPS trucks. It was on buildings. I know that there is a drag racer who actually has Taylor Swift's album cover on her car, on like three sides of her drag car that she's racing this weekend. So you cannot say that this woman didn't promote this new album. She has done a, an amazing job of that, but it's not on any streaming services. I woke up this morning, went to the gym, turned on Spotify. I wanted to listen to her new album, nothing. Her three singles were on Spotify, of course. Her old previous albums on Spotify, those just got added, actually. Taylor Swift has been beefing with streaming services for a long time. But I figured if her singles from this album are going to be on Spotify, then why is not the whole album on Spotify? So I'm a little mad about that, honestly. And I was reading some tweets. They said that it's not on Apple Music either. I really hope she does plan to add it to Spotify and Apple Music, though, because I pay money for those services. I'm expecting the latest music to be on there, and if Taylor Swift isn't on there, I'm going to find something else to listen to, and chances are good it might be better than Taylor Swift's. If you had a chance to listen to Reputation already, maybe you bought yourself a hard copy even, I would love to hear your thoughts on it. Leave your review of Reputation in the comments below.